Hey, this is XX Source Shoe with another tutorial. Uh, this tutorial is going to be on the bucket mod system. Basically, what I'm going to show you is different mods you can put on your bucket server from this cool website that ports them over from S SMP. So, let's go over to this website. Basically, it's just the Minecraft Port Central website. I'll link it in the description. So, if you want to learn how to do this, you just basically first thing you have to do is go to the craft bucket port mods for minecraft 1.2.5 grab yourself one of these builds and you're going to download it so you're just going to download the build so you just left click on it and wait for it to download <laughs> uh, and then just put it in the spot you'd like so we're going to go to my everything, my servers, my Minecraft PC, whatever that stands for, ported craft bucket, maybe? I'm not sure. So you put it in there. So I, I've made up an example server already, but I will, so basically you're just going to download it in here. And then you're going to pick a mod you'd like. This is kind of, I'm not exactly sure how this works, but these look like mods for 1.2.5. I'm not completely sure if they work or not from this side. All I know is that over here it's a lot more orthodox, but I'll just test one from over here. So let's try computer craft. How about that? Just see if that works. Alright. Oh, maybe industrial craft. Ah, uh, whatever. Okay, so we are in here. Alright. I'm just going to speed this up. So, one sec. Alright, then you're going to run your uh, craft bucket. Wait for that to load. Alright, once that's done, you're just going to go over to your... You're going to stop it. And you should have quite a few folders now. Uh, I think two more than usual. Actually, no, just one. Oh, maybe not. Config. That's a new one. So you're going to go over to wherever you downloaded your mod. So. I have this all set up. I'll have this downloaded in the description of my server with computercraft on it in case you are having troubles with this simple mod. Like the one I'm showing you might work or not. This is multi-page chest. It, I assume it's multi-page chest, simple enough. Alright, let's go into here. Let's run this one. This is just a multi-page chest I found on the web page. You can easily go to it by... I'm not sure if it's in here. Uh, this, these are like the, ma the bigger ones. It's like under ported mods. Uh, and it's the most popular mod apparently. Yeah. So, yeah this mod does work. I guess I'll have to show it in action so I'll have to download the client so when you go to your multi-page, when you go to your whatever you want, you make sure you get the client also. So let's go to one of the most views, and it should be top. Um, I'll find it in a sec. Uh, I just want to show a quick, uh, a quickie thing of me doing the client side. So right now I'm just attempting to download it to my client version. So for anyone who's new to this, I'll just give you a quick introduction uh, there we go so you're just gonna I don't really want this minecraft because I can't force update yeah you need to force update your minecraft so you have to find your actual minecraft wherever mine is this is it right here actually and then you wait for it to load up Alright, so we're back. I'm just going to force update to make sure this works. Alright, once it's done, it should just load up regular. Alright, so let me just open this, open this, type in percent app data percent. Minecraft bin. Just to clarify, that was percent app data percent. Okay? Okay.
open with WinRAR Archiver. The first thing you're going to do before you do anything is you're going to go over to this meta imp and you're going to hit the delete button. You don't want that there. The meta imp basically disables any sort of modifications to Minecraft to work. So if it, if it detects that there's no mine, there isn't any, um, or if there is mods on it, it will automatically close it off and not allow you to use them. So as soon as you do that, then you're ready to go. Okay. Basically, it's kind of smart way, of, so that way people can't complain or anything. Say if like you download a mod, it doesn't work out, and you want to force update, it will replace it with a meta inf, and then it will run again. I have a bunch of stuff in here. This might not help. Oh, I think I know it. Yeah, Flint's play mod from last time. What's magic? Hm. That's a lot. Magic. Be gone. And I'll just test if my Minecraft will start. As instructed, this one tells you to place it in your mod zip directory. If I can open it. Alright. Minecraft. Dot Minecraft. Mods. Take this little baby and drop it in here. I'm kidding, I don't drop babies. There. I just realized I downloaded the uh, server version and I was wondering why it wasn't working. Now I know. <laughs> huh. Alright, let's just drop that in there. Show in folder. And then get rid of that. Yes. Just get rid of it. Close. Goodbye. Alright, well, I like to install my mods using the MC Patcher. I don't know, it's a lot easier. Sometimes it screws it up, so I have to do it manually, but when I can, it's quite convenient. Alright, so, let's just go in, and what do you know, it works. So, let's just make sure. Um, oh, there you are. Multi page. Op. Hi, bye, guy. Probably should have thought this through before I even showed you this. Oh, well. There. There you go. Multi page chest. <laughs> well, some of them still aren't bug fixed yet. Porting error. But they'll be fixed eventually. I didn't even know that would happen. Uh, thanks for watching the video. Uh, go check out this guy's channel. And please comment on what would you like me to do a tutorial on next. That guy's channel, I'm pretty sure I'll be putting it up here somewhere. Maybe within this box. Yeah, probably in there. Alright. Uh, like, comment, and if you really like, subscribe. Thanks for watching. I hope this opened your eyes to now we have bucket ported mods. I I found out about this about a month ago. I decided to show you you guys this now. And see you later. Goodbye. Another thing I forgot to mention was if you guys wanted me to do it. A amnesia series. I was thinking about starting amnesia recording, but I wasn't sure if you guys wanted me to. Just let me know in the comments below.